Very well. Welcome back to Let's Play. Ease 2. Last time we completed 100% the high streets of Noltia. And today we're going to the next area. We need to return to Lance and upgrade, but before we do that, a little thing first. Mode of Burnet Bless. We had ice, now we have lava. I don't fear that someone worth watching it. And then, as quickly as it came, the sensation was gone. As Adol unfurled the scroll of guidance, words began to appear on the blank faded parchment. Great warrior, you've done well in reaching the region of Burnet Bless. This area of lava was created by the priest to shield against the demon's onslaught. It was no easy task to create such a drastic yet stable shift in the environment, but we did what was necessary to ensure our security. The only way to reach Solomon's Shrine is by traversing the path through the lava itself. You may find some nearby who could be of help to you. Be sure not to judge solely on appearances. It is also likely that you may find one of the priest's magic here, as well as other magical items. Please, warrior, do what you must to reach Solomon's Shrine. And the words faded away. So, we heard of some presence, right? What you have to do here is go here, go to the evil bell, and use it. As Edo listened closely, he could hear faint sounds of footsteps in the distance. Now, here's the thing. In the original, you have to do this. In this one, I think that if you know where the secret entrance here is, you can just go in. And here you are in the roost nest. Now these guys will not talk to you. They speak rue. Which I think you can probably translate. I think th there is a way to translate that. Except that I'm not going to bother. And instead, I'm going to use the magical transform to become a rue. And all the ruse have uh, the name that starts or has the the word rue in them. We were driven out of our homes by warmongering demons and forced to hide here. Ours is a peace-loving clan. Peace, love, sleep, food, and information. Ruki. Several days ago, I saw a human boy being led to the poison-filled passage by demons. I hope he's okay. You are? Ruru. Can't say I've seen you around before. Your name is Adol? No, here it isn't. Here, name is Adoru. It's the law. Yeah, apparently. Bruce. These are very stylish gauntlets, are they not? I made them myself. They help me remain calm. And calmness is most gentlemanly quality, don't you think? Demons and humans alike consider me a gentleman worthy of their greatest aspiration. As I'm sure do you. Humans always think that they were demons. But we're so not. We were originally thought of as sacred animals. Now people just see fur and think demon. I can let you in a little secret. My brother Bruce is a real loudmouth. Every time a demon starts chasing him, he's all like... Ah, okay, fine. I'm not gonna scream like that. A little secret. My brother Bruce is okay. Last time I talked to this guy, it said something different. It said that his brother Bruce, uh, Bruce forgets things like immediately after he does them. No, what was up with that? Drusy. And then there's this guy. Do you wish to rest? Sure, why not? Full heal, like that. Alright, get out of my magic now. I'll grab a rod of fruit, which I used before. So I'll replenish that. And a rod of leaf. This rod of leaf is mandatory. You have to get this. In the original, one of these roots would give it to you. You wouldn't have to pick it from the tree. You would just, like summon the roots in this area, and they would just... No, wait, I think you have to find it. The roots would just tell you, hey, uh, you gotta find you gotta find the, the leaf in this room, I think, and then you would just go there and do it. Anyway, let's begin the actual area. But we're just going to begin it. Because we can get some upgrades soon. We still have to upgrade. But wow, I, you can barely see these things. I used to call these dark demons, because in the original they looked like kind of ducks. Not in this one though. I'm gonna skip most of the monsters right now. I just wanna go. Yeah, take this exit right here. And then, over here... Boom! Iron ore for me. Yeah. Do that immediately. And then... Rens Village. 
As you can see, Rue's Nest is on my teleport list, so I can go back there in a jiffy. And we go, I will sell this iron ore to you. Hey, dude, I have an iron ore. Give me money. Is that the mystical glint of iron ore? I see you. Do my eyes deceive me? I bet last look will use some iron for smithing. What do you say? Yeah, 30, yeah 3k gold. All right, we're gonna buy shields then. Then large shield, how about that? 6k. Uh, what about armor? Nothing yet. Let's say armor. Plate mail. Okay, I'm gonna grab that. So we need... 6,000. Uh, for the other one. Sure. Little upgrade, but that always helps. Uh, I'm gonna be a Roo, I guess, and, uh... Oh, sure, I have to teleport. Can't be a Roo and teleport at the same time. They are two different magic. But now I'm gonna be a Roo, rest, recover my MPs, and then move on. Alright, let's take a look at that armor. Yeah. Much better. Okie dokie. Now, let's try to get through this area. They're also partially invisible. Wow. Why did they make them so hard? Ow. That took away a lot of my health. I have to be careful here. Now, this is a big ass maze, guys. And now, this exit over here, I can actually try to show you. What happens if you keep going this way, past the iron ore, you'll get in trouble. Eventually. Eventually you'll get in trouble, not immediately. You'll eventually get in trouble. Oh, this guy... Oh, crap. Well, welcome to East 2, what you got? Just have to do this. Win every fight. Spam some fireballs. Okay, maybe, maybe don't do it with every monster. But you know it's free experience. Welcome. This is the game. Yeah, it's a bit broken, isn't it? These guys are much easier to kill, but I'm guessing they're gonna do a lot of damage. I thought that I would eventually get stopped by something, but it looks like I'm I can go pretty far for some reason you kill that thing give me the XP oh oh okay wait a minute okay Yeah, okay, if you go in here, the air is thick with poison gas. It's too dangerous to go any further. Uh, do you lose elf? You do, but very, very, very slowly. You have no idea how fast that drains in the original. Like, super fast. We're talking, like, insanely fast drain. Okay. I'll wait here and recover just a bit. I was in fact scared that I was going not I was not gonna react fast enough that my head would just drop to zero. <laughs> Is that that's what used to happen in the original. Like you wouldn't drop to zero, but remember how your elf just drains in the corridor in the evil corridor in the arm tower? Yeah, that same speed basically. You would get drained at the same speed. In any case. Since we can't go that way. Well, we could go that way. Actually, we could go that way. But it's not appropriate for us to do it now. Let's actually do what the game wants us to do. Do things correctly. We're going to go this way. And now, now we're going to actually fight stuff. I don't want to feel underleveled. The next boss, we have to be at level. Well, let me take a look at that. While I record some of my HP. 28. 
It was level 24. So, yeah. We're gonna have to do some fighting. Okay, that's the only exit. It'll actually take a while before we get to the next... There's a town here. That, so, it'll take a while before we get there. Looking around for any monster to fight. There are no items if that really... If if you want to know, there are no items around here. Unlike in the Ice Ridge where there are, there were chests everywhere. No chests here. Nothing to miss apart maybe the Iron Ore that I showed you. Maybe there'll be an herb, but even, even that. Like, do you really? Do you really need a herb? You probably don't. Okay, look at those guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They give like what? It's 25 experience? It's a lot. And this place is huge. It was much smaller in the original. Still mazy, but... Ow, okay. That did some serious damage. These guys are the strongest right now. Look at that. Takes so much to kill. Anything down here? More enemies. Sure. Dun, 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 dun. Oop, oop, oop. Okay. Level up. Three more levels to go. I think we're almost to the town, really. Shouldn't take that long unless I die. Which can totally happen if I'm not careful. Don't want to lose all that progress. Once I'm in town, I can just teleport back to it. I could go. I can go to the rouge, and yeah, there we go. This is what I can do. Look, go to the rouge nest. Pull restore. And go back to the town we just arrived in. Up. Oh, I do wish to rest. Thanks. Uh, yeah, it costs 20 to teleport. Here we go. Then let's talk to the people. Anytime I go near the goddess statue at the entrance to the ice streets, I get the feeling I'm being watched. Oh, there are rouge hiding around there? Well, that explains it. I guess I am being watched when I'm there. Yeah. This area is warming with demons, too. As such, we almost never see the rouge anymore. Divine messengers, if you will. They're such cute little things. Of course or no. Wonder where they all went. They have, they're hiding. No, right here. Get out, scram. What? Why? What did I do? Is this East 4 all over again where every time you go, you've done something and you don't remember it? You're... I'm who? I'm Adol Christian. I'm not right here right now. Leave a message and I'll get back to you. Wait, what? What does that mean? Uh, we want to look for a person, actually. Uh, let me see my notes. Yeah, Nash. This guy. I remember right. So, we are going to give you stuff, Nash, my man. Now, thanks, but no thanks. Uh, thanks, but no... Are we even giving this guy stuff? No, we are not. Apparently... Okay, I think I know why. I can't give it to, anything to him. Outsider. Yeah. Uh, the equip, thanks. You're... My metal Christian. What's up? Oh my, right here. What? So bad to have there around here? What do you think doing barging into someone's home like this? This is an RPG, man. This is what we do. Take some fireballs. Are you the one? Yeah, I am the only one and only, man. You! Your head's so red. Is that natural? Is that the blood of your enemies? Probably a combination of both. That's your natural air color? Seriously? Nah, that's the blood of my enemies, man. Actually, come to think of it, didn't someone just say something about redhead just recently? That everyone is talking about it. I think it was Ruba. Something about Parf. Oh, I just can't remember. You the one? You look the part, alright? 
Grandpa won't leave me go outside because it's dangerous. But I want to go find Tarf and play with him. And Grandpa Ruba won't tell me where he is, which is real annoying. Grown-ups are weird sometimes. Like, if you don't want to fall in the lava, you, well, there are fences, but I guess... There are no fences here, you could just drip down and fall in the lava, and that's it. Now, can I read this? No adventure aside alone, the demon's numbers have been increasing lately, and keep watch over your children. I think we entered this house, so let's go over here. Staring? I wasn't staring. Red hair. Did we enter this house? We didn't, but no one is here. And more pickers. Hmm, a redhead. I'm Ruba, the bridge guard. And you are? I see. So you're Adol. I'm sorry, but the bridge is which winch was broken by some demons and won't go down. For the time being, there's no way to repair it either. You won't be able to get across. Oh, well, that's a shame. I wonder if you're gonna say something to a demon. Aru? I suppose the demons made a slave of you too. You'll come to check on me, I suppose? Has promised that I haven't let Adol cross. Tell me, tell me, tell the man in Black Cloak that I'm doing what he said, so he'd better give me my son back. Elus is going to keep coming back, though. You won't know that, right? You know that, right? Even much harder to turn away too each time he does. So whatever you're doing, it do it fast. Yep, dude, we know about that now. You know you're being, uh, what was that you say? Uh, like blackmailed or something like that. Wait, so that room was... I see, so you know everything then. It all started two days ago. Tarf! Dad! I read the air swordsman by the name of Adol will be coming through here soon. Do not let him cross the bridge. Just do as you're told and your son will be returned unarmed. Tarf! So Tarth was taken, and those were the instructions for ensuring his safe return. You must have noticed how the villagers have been regarding, you know? It's because they all know what happened. I bear you no grudge, but I'll do what I must to ensure Tarth's safety. Sure, we'll offer to rescue Tarth. Yeah. You must be joking, you're up against demons here. Then again, you're the one that they're trying to stop, so clearly you are a threat to them. I guess maybe. You're not joking. Okay, if that's the way you wish it to be, who am I to object? I'll leave Tarth's rescue in your hands. I wish I could help you, but if they think we're acting against them, they'll hurt Tarth and possibly the village. Here, take these in my place. They should prove quite useful. And you get whisper hearings. They're called whisper hearings. They've been passed down in my family for generations. When you're wearing them, you'll be able to hear even the faintest of sounds. My son must be in prison somewhere around here. Listen through those and you might be able to hear it. Alright, and then I think that's gonna be about it for now. Next time on Ease 2, we will explore the Moth of Burned Blessed further and try to rescue Darth. See you guys next time.